All right, let's do this challenge together. This is really similar with the previous exercise we just did in the previous video. Uh, the difference is this is just pulling contact list instead of a count list. So that's really simple. So you have to watch the previous video first because we are going to skip this LDS utils which we already did, okay? So basically, we want to define a getter for a property named errors and use the reduce error function in the getter. So basically, I'm going to scroll up from the previous instructions and just work on the contact list. So it's really similar, all right? First, I want to open my contact list and put this template. Okay, I'm going to copy that. Flip back to my Visual Studio Code. LWC, we have contact list over there. Open that up, contact list HTML. Let's put this there. Boom. That's the first step. And then we did this one, okay? So basically, you go to LWC recipes. I'm going to actually show this again to you and create a new web component, LDS utils in your Visual Studio code, which I already did here. So create that, basically you paste um, the JS, okay, from here, you get the code by clicking there, get the code, the whole code there, paste it here, and also the XML, and then deploy it, okay, once you've done that, right click and deploy. We did that on the previous video, so we're not going to do that again. So we skip this part, which we already did, I'm going to close that up. So flip back here, I'm going to close this up. And next up is, um, we're going to modify the JS for the contact controller. I'm going to copy this, include uh, the, the LDS utils from the contact list.js. Then put the LDS utils there. And then we are going to do the errors, the getter. Copy that, put it here, but we have to modify this. This is contacts, not accounts, contacts, not accounts, all right? Save that guy, and then we're going to modify the class, the get account class, okay, from a, a contact controller. I'm going to copy this guy and go to my classes folder contact class a uh, contact controller class open that up i'm going to comment this out command kc and then paste force error for card or let's just stick to the plan okay i'm going to save that because today tell us what to do and what error to put because challenges are very very you know they're very, you know, you have to exactly do what they want. They don't see, they don't say, right, what I have to put there. No, they don't say it. Okay, we just need to deploy it. So, deploy the controller first. Deploy this first. Make sure you deploy the class first. You need to update this, okay? Done. And then we're going to deploy the actual contact list and deploy source to org and then we're going to see if it works i'm going to flip back to my playground over here i think one of these is the contact list maybe this one is the contact list right so i'm going to just refresh this guy woohoo force error force error that's it so let's grab our points from here and um check challenge and get the points all right that concludes our um, lightning web components and salesforce data module i'll see you in the next module bada bing bada boom woohoo shiny new batch how helpful was this batch very helpful 
Alright, let's tackle the next module. Hit that subscribe button and explore new trailhead grounds and learn to implement the most useful and popular apps on the Salesforce App Exchange. And do yourself a favor, like this video and you'll be surprised on how much more you understand when watching this same video after liking it. Don't take my word, watch this one more time after you like the video and see it for yourself. Bada bing, bada boom.